Alrighty, so we finally got working the new revamped Blackguard. New spells. The Wrath of Tulkis. These sound like end game spells, but they're early game spells. Interesting. Anyway, I'm looking forward to trying out the new, the new class. The new kind of uber warrior, as I like to think of it. What do we want to buy? What do we want to buy? We need a weapon. We're, we're a melee artist here. We need a broadsword. Or a trident. Trident is slightly better. Do you like the trident? Trident is very nice. High, high level of randomness and the amount of damage it does. That's kind of fun. I'll do like three of these and like nine. Can I only get nine of those? Should we get food? We're half troll warriors, so we're gonna get a lot of food. We don't have anything to throw, but that's alright. Let's test it out. How much damage? 11? That's pretty good. Crush them. Crush them dead. Crush them all, that's what I say. 140, that's pretty good for this depth. <sighs> we can't kill a floating eye, he'll kill us first. Um, that's unfortunate, should have brought something to throw. Could throw some potions at him, but... I guess he didn't go anywhere anyway, just to this room. Wow. 48. Torch is nice. So I still can't learn any spells? Do I need a certain amount of intelligence to learn a spell? Maybe I won't be able to learn any spells for like the first half of the game because I won't find an intelligence snap potion or something. I don't know. I don't know the answer to these questions. I am merely a playtester of a new total revamp blackguard class. Did I lose my mana from somebody? Who's taking my mana from me? I don't get it. Where did my mana go? Oh yeah, I lose mana. There's something I forgot about that. So I'm losing mana all the time. And when I do something, I gain mana, but I don't remember what I have to do. Kill a monster, kill a lot of monsters, be in the line of sight of a lot of monsters. There's some funky mechanics happening here, which is why I wanted to try this out, because it's so... Just so very different than normal. Well, there's grip. Grip will die easy enough. So I had some mana for a little bit there, and then it went away. Now I have some mana. Now it's already gone. So the mana is going away very quickly. I probably should hang out for a little longer. I can finally learn it. So berserk strength. Well, see, I already did know A. I just can't use any of my spells. Now I can. Oh, wait. I'm confused. So I haven't learned Seek Battle. Have I learned it? And what does is, what is this do? It is. It's actually Berserk Strength. Does it actually give me health, too, or just, just the AC stuff? A plus 1.5 times level turns. Not very long. We're going to try that out once we kill something, but we're not killing that jelly because jellies aren't. Where the hell are the stairs, man? I do apologize in advance for any swearing that I will do in this video. I uh, haven't been getting out much lately, incidentally. So I'm a little stir crazy. I'm a little stir. I'm a little stir crazy. It's like all Alright. Just gonna have to bear with me a little bit. Oh, it's a big shield for a 
early game. Esther Charms, I do like that book. Ooh, could be a brightness. We need to find a mob. A mob of, here we go. M A B. M A B. Did I do it? Can't be fighting while I'm stunned. So, so far, so far, you know, trying to cast a spell when you have 50% fail rate is really dumb. You're better off just killing stuff. But, we got nothing to do during this waiting for him to come to us. We might as well try to cast. So, this is my typical experience with 50% fail rate. That it's really 80% fail rate. That's, that's generally how I experience that. And that is being borne out right now. Right now we're at 100% fail rate. We've tried casting it at least four times. Seek battle. <laughs> I think I know what that spell does. That's pretty funny. It probably just shows you where the monsters are. <laughs> but instead of, like, detect monsters so you don't get killed, it's... Here's where the monsters are. Go get them. It's very clever. It's very amusing. Hey, protecting my money pouch, but I don't have any AC or dexterity. Craziness. I'm not complaining, mind you. Blessings, handy. Mana's gone, and the mana comes back. Two five. Well, the brightness torch wouldn't be a five, I don't think. I think that's a little bit excessive. So I'm going to assume we have not found the object yet. And that, um... I don't think there's torches of shadow, so I don't really. Want, I just don't want to try the torch until I need it. Well, now I gotta wait for the beat on me so I can cast my berserk strength. Little beat on me so I can cast my berserk strength. Hey! Watch out, everybody! We're berserk. We've gone berserk! That's what I'm talking about. Come on, where's my dagger of nymphthank? Wait, I thought I set up my... Uh... Okay, good. I don't like to play with standards for some reason. Although it's probably... I used to think that randarts were better because you get some crazy weapons with randarts. You get better launchers sometimes. You get better melee weapons sometimes. But the overall inconsistency of it. And then, you know, you get things like Ringel, and then you get Kubergol, and you can wear two rings of damage. So. That doesn't happen in, uh. You don't get high, you don't get end game weapons that have plus 10 speed in, in standards. At least I don't. Although I did get a f 75 with plus 7 speed. That was pretty awesome. That happened in my last game. Come here so I can kill ya. That's not gonna do the trick. Oh, here we go. This is gonna be, this is gonna be fun. Oh, we're stunned. That's bad. I don't want to use a phase yet. Wait, we're stunned. We can't do this if we're stunned. I forgot. So we're going to have to phase, unfortunately. We 
have nothing to throw at this. We have the dagger to throw. Let's throw the dagger. There we go. And we're not stunned, so... I kind of missed the crowd control melee that I had in the other version of this. Um, well, I think we'd be effed. I think we'd be effed. We're going to run out of phase doors real quick. Um, trying to think what options I have right now. Could try some potions, but I'd rather not. I guess I'm gonna wait for them to come at me. Darn, I'm confused again. Well, ooh. should I bless myself? I guess I'll bless myself. throw a torch at him, it's kind of ridiculous. Cool, so now, I, now I'm low on healing, but I'm fine on phase doors. So the healing situation is going to be a problem. I guess the bad save is a problem, we're going to get confused a lot. We're going to have to be able to fight through our confusion. If we're gonna have a chance of surviving. Dude, we already have this room. What the freaking hell? Shush you. I don't want a deep descent scroll. Not yet. Not until I find the five object. Where's my money? My throwing ability is pretty weak. I think I'd do like 2 damage or something. 2.5! I was right. I made a guess and I was right. Oh no! So now we wait for somebody to hit us. So that we can gain some, uh, there we go, try B again, didn't work, we get beaten on a little bit, there we go, well if you, this isn't going to work, we're going to have to phase. Come on! Take that, buddy! So these spells are friggin' horrible in the beginning. Not only are they really hard to cast, they don't they don't last for for nothing. Are we gonna get like something decent at one point? It could be a could be a scroll that's making the five. But just to be certain, I have to wait till I'm pretty sure that I've explored the whole level before I read it, because it could be deep descent. And you know what I'm saying? Nice, more food. Ready? 
Ready? What could it be? Where could the fiver be? Slow start to our game. I don't really like it when the game starts slowly like this. The other, my other half guard had a really smooth, easy start. The one, of, the normal one, the one from the current version of the game. It's friggin' just crushed everything. I don't think I had a good starting weapon, particularly. Not as good as this trident. Well. Should I read a scroll? Or should I explore some more? There's like one hallway I haven't looked at, I guess. It's not going to be banishment, but it might be something good. I don't know what. Chain weapon? No. Ah! La 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 la. No objects in here. What is it going to be? Is it going to be a scroll? Right, I've looked, I've looked, I've looked. Oh, there's one hallway I haven't looked in. Is that food? So one cool thing about, I guess, the black card is that, like, all those mana draining dudes, they're going to have, like, no effect on him. So you can just ignore them. Alrighty, let's go to the stairs and read some scrolls. I'm giving up on the five objects. Right? I don't... I don't think it's a torch of brightness, I really don't. It's teleport level. How, how extraordinarily unexciting. I guess teleport level, I guess, is sort of like dungeon, I don't know, dungeon 25 maybe? I don't think of dungeon, I don't think of teleport levels really all that amazing. Two Wands of Wonder. Now we are in freaking business, my friends. Early Wonders are just, not only are they super fun, but they're super friggin' useful. I mean, they, they make for a very interesting early game in my experience. So this is very, a very good omen, a very good situation here. I'm gonna ignore that guy. Did our, did our casting ability improve yet? Still 50%? Well, it's because we don't have any mana. We'll see what it is when we get mana. stuff now. 50%. We've cast it twice and we've we've successfully casted it twice and we've attempted to cast it about 10 times. So we have about a 20%, maybe a 23% freaking success rate. It's pretty garbage, man. It's pretty garbage. It's pretty garbage. Come on, let's go. Hey, here we go. Now we're cooking with gas. When in doubt, fire your wand of teleport. I mean, your wand of wonder. We don't need, and we never will need, a wand of heal monster. Alright, where are we going? Sorry, dude, but that's what happens. I don't know why I'm throwing bolts and I can fire, fire shots, but that's what happens.
Nice. I don't really need the dagger anymore. Or the dagger is not going to do nearly as much damage as the trident. Oh, I have three mana. Still garbage, uh. Garbage. Garbage casting ability. Whoa! Oh, ho, ho! Rubble in the house! Rubble in the house. I uh, do like digging under rubble. Pays off from time to time. How do I make a percent sign for the for the for the magma veins instead of a blank square? I don't probably berserk strength is I don't want to lose the AC. The AC is protecting me from getting robbed. Can only cast B. Can only cast B. Here he comes. Nineteen damage, is that all? It's pretty weak. Uh, longbow power does 53 damage with average arrows. I think that's pretty awesome. <laughs> I used my elbow to cover that sneeze. Even though I am alone in my own house. And alone. Nobody is in this house. I'm quarantined. Quarantining. Oh my. Level one, level three, level five, level seven, but I'm all of those levels. Bastard. Kill you next time I see you. It's funny, you can't ever kill uh, Smeagol on the level that, you, that he appears. He's one of the few, I guess if you get a thank weapon early, you can kill him, but if you don't, he's one of the few uniques that you really can't fight when you're, when he shows up at native depth. Actually, that's not entirely true. I can, I could, well, I'll say to waste all my wonder on him. Magic Missile. Should I use Wonder on him? I don't think I should. I think I'll just let him steal my money instead. I don't want to. I don't want to waste all my charges on him. There's better targets for killing, such as the Yeek Boulder Yeek and the and the Boulder and the Bolt. What's the other one's name? Boulder and I don't remember the other one's name. Oh well, I guess we're gonna kill him. Where'd he go? We're not doing any damage to him. Alright, that's pretty good. We can't detect him. He's just gonna heal up while we screw around wondering where the hell he is. Go there, Smeagol. Smeagol! I have something for you! How can I hit this guy? I need to eat food, that's why I can't hit him.
Shatterstone. What does that do? Destroys and Toto. What the fuck? What does that mean? Destroys and Toto. Is that grammatically incorrect? Destroys a Toto. Section of wall or rubble, unless it is a permanent wall. Deals 20 plus 1d30. Damage to monsters vulnerable, vulnerable to rock remover. That sounds quite interesting, to be honest. I ain't gonna lie, that sounds interesting to me, and I'd like to try that out. Some terraforming. A little bit of terraforming while you're being beat on, I guess. My man is not driving below one, that's kind of cool. No, it did. Oh, we lost Smeagol. Well. Smeagol, you have... Let me down. Well, um... I don't know really what that did for me, actually, but okay. I will at some point figure out the use of that spell, but right now it's a little bit going to be a little bit of a mystery. Let's try Berserk Strength. Stunned so easily. Well, it's not rightness, it's just a curse of some kind, so I think we will leave that on the dungeon floor. We're gonna run, run out of food long before we're gonna run out of light. It's a three mana spell, I guess. I want to seek battle or whatever. So we wasted five charges on Smeagol. Oh well. No, I shouldn't have friggin' wasted them on him. Oh well. That's how it goes sometimes. How many are there of those? Characters. Oh, I got Cure Light Wounds again. That's good. So I'm in very good shape right now. Very good. I've, I've stabilized after that early scare with all those acolytes. Level 2, I think it was. I have stabilized. Everything's going to be just fine. So I guess one downside of having poor, or having depleting mana is that I don't get to use my spells to get into rock. I can't have to, <laughs> getting into a, getting into a vault will be kind of interesting. I'll have to wait for a monster to be around me, wait to get beat on, then use my mana to break the rock into the vault. The you know, I have to be careful not to kill the monsters first. So I kill the monsters first. And then I won't be able to get into the vault anymore. Because I won't have any mana to cast a spell to break the rock. Of course, I can always drill and I'm, I'm always going to be, well, in the early game I won't always be strong enough. But it's not long before I'll be strong enough to get into a vault. Should we look for the three object? I, I'm impatient really. I want to keep going. I don't have good hit points like I did the last game. I have 123 is low for for this combination of character class and race. I had good I had good I had good hit points on my last game though. Well the game is still going, but I stopped playing it when I realized I had the wrong 
the wrong version of the game, the normal version of the game loaded. So that's a little unfortunate. I might play it anyway though, I was enjoying it. I liked the uh, the range of the range of damage effect with the melee attack. That was pretty awesome. And when I find a really good weapon, that's gonna be off the chain ridiculous. Two four. What's the two? What's the four gonna be? Paralyte wounds. It will not be. He has a lot of hit points. I don't remember him having so many hit points. Seat battle. Seat battle. Na, 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 na. Got me. He got me. That could be treasure detection. That would be awesome if that was treasure detection. Let me get in the center of the level before I read it. A little far south, a little east, a little more south. I'm gonna go south. Is that good for treasure detection? So far enough south? Let's go south. Is that far enough south? That's pretty good for treasure detection. Uh, of course, it's not even treasure detection, but you know. You never know. What, is it, what does it do? Whoa! There it is, folks! I guess I gotta do it on the trident, right? So that's not bad, I just plus two plus two my trident, not terrible. I really think those scrolls should do a little bit more damage in the early in on an empty on a zero zero weapon. It should do like five plus five to damage. I mean plus two is like hey, you found two scrolls of to hit and two scrolls of to damn. Big whoop de do. You know, an enchant weapon scroll is supposed to be a big deal and it doesn't even do all that much. I think it should do like plus five to dam or something. That's just my opinion. Plus five to dam, plus five to hit. It's just my opinion, man. I'm actually surprised it's only a four treasure feeling. That's about right, though. Pretty trash tier, tier scroll, really. Three wonder! Woo Where are we going? Where are we? Where art thou? Oh, let's burn through my light scrolls, why not? Probably save him for a more dangerous room than an empty room, but... Oh. I 
just making a note of what level I found it on in case when I go to the stores and I drop my potions, I'll drop that one last. I'll make sure to buy Cure Serious or Cure Critical before I drop it. Because it might be something good like that. Or I'll buy Terrorism before I drop it. You know what I'm saying. Searching. Oh, 0.714. Well, it's still better damage. What are we getting rid of? I don't know that we're going to really use the magic missile so much. I guess we could just eat our food. Plus, plus one tunnel. This is like a horrible shovel. It might do acid damage though. I don't know. I wish I'd held on to that scroll of enchantment now. Tolwar is going to do 15, so already we're throwing away our trident. It's going to be 16.8. So maybe we just don't even bother with the Tolwar. Just figure that the acid is going to be most of the time good enough. There's very few things of this step that are going to resist acid. Right? Assassin. It's a nice upgrade. Did I burn it? Did I learn anything? Still fifty percent. Oh yeah, yeah. I Probably have done more int at the start of my game. Maybe I should have taken a class that has some native int instead of negative int. I think this has like negative int. could be free action and it could also be paralysis. Isn't that fun? We don't know. And hopefully they're free action and not paralysis. Although this step they're probably not free action. They probably are paralysis. Or poison or something. I guess we should try to find some money. trying to use some of my potions, but... Finally, I found the money. I don't normally go, but I don't normally dig deeper than the, than the nearest vein, but because I have a digging implement, I might as well. better spells yet? Eh. The length of time has increased though, now it's 17 plus T17. It's pretty nice. Now the recall is nice. What are we doing? Let's just take the stairs. It's 
for it, buddy. I'm gonna kill a machine. So I guess heroism is better than berserk strength. If you're not getting the healing with berserk strength, the AC penalty is kind of not very good. Check this real quick and then we'll hit the stairs. Hi, fighter. Dude, savagery. I would like to find battles, man. I like that spell. Regeneration. Palms preserve rage and bloodlust so that you can regain HP from resting. Ends taunt. Uses all your SPs at once. Palms berserk rage like meditation for berserker. Interesting. Interesting. So I guess I get beat up in a battle, I cast that spell. Something like that. So M A E. I have to have total max HP, SP, that's kind of annoying. All right, well, you can be that way. Die trying to cast a stupid spell, that's not very good. Casted friggin' savagery. I think you, this should stay at max SP for at least like three turns. This idea it, it drops off so quickly. I don't know. I mean, casting smooth savagery right now would be nice. Uh, it's probably a good time to try out potions, although I don't really want to. I don't want to waste a speed potion. I guess five is probably not going to be a speed potion. No, just cloth it. I thought that would be that. Larger stacks are less likely to be speed potions. Alright, I didn't bother trying out all my potions right now. So, it's a magic mushroom. Rods of light are slightly overpowered, which makes them really fun. Because they recharge so quickly, the recharge time should be less, should be slightly more. I'm not really complaining, but it's pretty fun, but still. It's a nice way to get a to get ahead in the early game. What is my tour? I know we're using my tour. I'm not really sure why I'd lug it around. Cause he might resist acid for all I know. Did I hit him? Seems that I've missed him. I do dissolve them though, so I don't. I need to get away from it. This is this is a wonder target for me right now. I have no idea if he can even reach me. Oh, <gasps> it's just a long bow of averageness. And I have nothing to get excited about. Where did he go? 
Oh, this is annoying. I want to I want to blast him from a distance. I don't want to blast him. Now I need the friggin' light room and I don't have it. God darn it. And I can't cast for seek battle. Flying blind here. Oh, I can do light though. So, I think he's over here. No, I hit the zero button. Darn it. I hate that. When I hit the screw up the targeting because the targeting is very intuitive and it makes me angry. Why is it oh like this is it's so random. Zap you do zap no, it doesn't let's try again zap for star oh like oh did it did it work or am I just gonna shoot into the friggin stupidness There it worked. No, it's not working. It's targeting. Yeah, it is targeting. Is it working? It's skipping two. Why is it skipping two? It usually skips one. Anyway, I want to do it in that. Okay, I see what's happening. I see what's happening. See, it already dropped off. I, I can't friggin' I wanna See they don't want me to phase away, they want me to stay in the battle. I'm not gonna survive staying in the battle. I do 50% success rate, I gotta get away first. So I don't get to do Sooth Savagery. I guess I can do Zerk. Except that I fail more times than I succeed. I guess I could do magic missile. Oh, went away again. Oh well. Ah, uh, let's do light wound. 